There are over a thousand dams in Vermont and the Nature Conservancy is committed to reconnecting waterways by removing some of the dams that are no longer serving any useful purpose. When we took a look at this particular dam, we knew that there was an opportunity to restore stream habitat, to connect 98 miles of fisheries and fisheries habitat, to provide some flood resiliency, and also to provide recreational opportunities. One of the, the most important things that the White River Partnership does is improve fish habitat and fish passage, and um, removing structures is a really key component to that. The Randolph Dam is a, an 80-foot wide, 5-foot tall structure, and when you look at it, it doesn't look terribly large or imposing, but from a, an aquatic organism passage standpoint, our native species can only jump about a foot, and so a 5-foot tall barrier, even though it doesn't seem fairly large in, in the scale of the watershed, has a real impact on those fish species. So taking out the dam will allow fish to travel upstream to find food, to lay their eggs, to find cold water during a hot summer. And overall, it just improves the, the health of the river system. It's able to function naturally from top to bottom. I feel really lucky to live in this area and have the opportunities to fish on the White River. I think it's a really beautiful and unique watershed with uh, long undammed portions already on the main stem and now to have this dam removed on the third branch is a great benefit for us and this should increase fish populations and from a community perspective is really desirable because we've got this beautiful little downtown it's right there where the dam removal was so you have recreation both for angling and for a paddling and just swimming wading in the river people are really gonna enjoy that area Projects like this one, they're significant. They require a lot of resources. And so it's important for us to be able to work with our partners, with government agencies, with the communities, and with our members in order to bring those resources together to get these projects done.